Labs, a full service marketing agency. Today's guest is Maya. Maya, feel free to introduce yourself and let your, our viewers know about your background. My name is Maya Ratcliffe. I am the founder and CEO of Hawaii Fluid Arts. And I used to be a corporate banker uh, working for one of the major banks in the United States and decided to branch out and become my own boss. Amazing. What, what inspired you to quit? create the brand? It actually was started by accident. Um, we, I was taking hobby classes in Hawaii. I lived there for nine years. I was taking art classes and everything I tried, it was absolutely terrible at. And so I just started playing with my own art forms and started posting them on Facebook. And soon people started asking me to teach. So I opened a studio in my two car garage. And in the first six months, I taught a thousand people. And then I opened my first retail location and moved on from there. And now we have 46 stores around the US that we've opened in the last two years. And we are the fastest growing art franchise in the nation. That's amazing. That is, that, that's really, that's awesome to hear. Who, who is the ideal target audience for the brand? Well, it really depends if you're talking about consumer, so student who would come and take an experience, or if you're talking about potential business partner as far as a franchisee. We could talk about both. So our ideal student is anybody from two to 102, whether it's business to business or business to consumer. We work with independent school districts, homeschool groups, senior centers. We work with businesses for team building events. We do birthday parties, ladies nights out, et cetera. We have over 27 different art forms. So people with any ability or different ability can experience a fun art class at a Hawaii fluid art near them. And as far as franchisees, we're looking for business partners that are savvy, but also know how to follow a system. The whole reason that somebody gets into franchising is because it's been built for them. So we want somebody with an entrepreneurial spirit who still understands that guidelines are guidelines. Definitely. What makes you different than say some of your competitors? Multiple things. When you talk about the experiences themselves, most competitors are painting a bird on a branch in front of a barn. Like I said, we have 27 different art forms, everything from fluid art to resin art, to skateboards, to making your own hat. We have our own paint brand, our own resin brand, our own canvas brands. That's what makes us a little different on the art side and for the consumer. But as far as different compared to most brands on the market as a franchise opportunity, we have more support than just about any other brand on the market. We have 16 support people. We have everything from real estate acquisition to construction management to a full in-house ad agency, as well as we're very fast to open with a very affordable $184,000 price point to open your doors. Awesome. What what is the most popular service or class that you have right now? Good golly. It's either going to be fluid art or the resin tumbler class where you can create anything from a 12 by 12 canvas all the way up to a four foot by five foot canvas or the resin tumblers where you can create your own custom beautiful tumbler. Great. What is the future plan for yourself and this awesome brand? Well, Hawaii Fluid Art is on target to have 350 locations open within the next 24 months. And we have big plans after that. We will be expanding into the Asian markets, Canada, and the Middle East into Dubai. So we are growing quickly, but doing it uh, at a smart pace. And we're really looking forward to what the future holds for us. Definitely, definitely. What's, what's been the most successful way to promote the brand and growth so far? marketing wise? Uh, word of mouth. Uh, we are very popular, but also I do a lot of media uh, appearances. I'm a Fox contributor, so that helps a little, as well as we have a very strong social media presence. We have, we're very artistic, obviously brand. We're very visual. Um, so like, for instance, our website is two years old. It's right in the process of being completely rebuilt. A new very dimensional, fun website where all the franchisees have sub pages and uh, people find out about us through Google. You know, if you Google art classes or Hawaii fluid art, there's a lot of information out there. Great. What advice, most of our listeners are entrepreneurs and they have e-commerce brands. Um, what advice could you give an entrepreneur that's looking to start a brand here in the next few years? Be prepared to work very hard and invest all the money that you have because for true success, you have to risk. You have to believe in yourself 100% and go all in. 
you have to grind, you have to put in the hard work and the hard hours and don't live a life that you can't afford because that money needs to be spent on improving your brand. What are some challenges that you faced in the past few years and how were you able to overcome them? Let's see, challenges that we faced. Well, I started my business during COVID, which was kind of crazy. Uh, yeah. And then we've had a couple bad franchisees, people that I didn't vet properly that I brought into the brand that were kind of a cancer. I've helped them. Mm -hmm gracefully exit the brand by selling their location and moving on. So that's one thing is you want to be sure that you go into business with people that are trustworthy, capable, good human beings. Uh, the other is I bootstrap this business. So, you know, at times there's always a cash flow issue, but in reality, the brand is worth over $20 million and I don't have any partners and I don't owe any money on it. That's amazing. And, and what, um, what states are you in as of right now? Uh, we are in everywhere from Hawaii to California, Florida, all over the place but we have we will be in every state in the nation except for alaska by the middle of next year have open stores we've got so many of them sold across the country awesome awesome and then your website is hawaiianfluentart.com um what any, anything else that you would want our listeners to know about yourself and the brand that i haven't asked you not really we're just here to help we're information givers we don't have a sales team we just believe in providing information that's as transparent as possible to future business partners that's amazing well i really appreciate you uh coming on and sharing your story and your brand and i appreciate your time today i really do absolutely it's my pleasure thank you definitely thank you